Field for Cascade Sports. Coach, state your name for the audience. Matt Miller. Mr. Miller, uh, I mean Coach Miller, tell me a little bit about your history. Uh, did you play sports in high school or college? Yeah, I played basketball in college at Lake Erie College. I've uh, been here in Bedford for 11 years, uh, middle school for four years, and came up here as an assistant to Coach Ever Heard for four years, and this is my third year as a head coach after Coach Ever What do you think about that game today? I'm glad it worked out. I'm glad it worked out for us. Uh, for a while there, I was starting to think it might not be going our way, especially you know, we missed those foul shots down the stretch. Still kids that big three at the buzzer. They had all the momentum. They came out. They got the lead. It started overtime, but you know we got we got we start four seniors, guys that have been playing for a while. They got poised. They didn't hang their heads. They stuck with it. They kept grinding, grinding, grinding. We went eight for ten from the foul line in the fourth in, the, in overtime, and you know that was that was ballgame right there. Tell me a little bit about what kind of team you have. Well, we we got plays that we start four seniors, um, and then you know we got uh, another sophomore that starts, another sophomore comes off the bench, two freshmen come off the bench, another junior, and then another senior. So we're real inexperienced. Um, you know, we're, we're lucky to be off to a four and zero start with playing the amount of guys that don't have experience. And quite honestly, don't quite know what they're doing yet out there, but they're learning on the fly. Luckily, we've been able to win these games. Uh, but they're learning, they're improving. They're, they're going to be some special players, but we're young, we're inexperienced. Luckily, I said we got we got Aaron, we got Chris, we got Dawood, we got three seniors that have been playing varsity for three or four years. Carl, uh, Carl's a fourth senior starter. You know, they're adding some stability with those young guys to kind of keep things all held together for now. So you got a pretty deep team. Right? Yeah, I like, like I, said, I, I like what we got. I like our, I like our bench. I got confidence going. 10, 11 guys deep right now, and um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm pretty confident with the bench. We got. So how did y'all do last year in the, the tournament? Uh, we we won our first game against John Adams. Uh, then we played Heights, who was number one seed. Uh, we lost them by three. We had a, we had a good look at the bottom of the tie, but we, we couldn't get it to go. Um, we actually play Heights coming up on Tuesday. It's going to be a very tough game, but you know we battled and battled. We you know we we unfortunately had to play Heights first or the second game of our tournament was the number one seed. But uh, you know we battled them, only lost by three. But. Yeah, I've covered that solo district, and that seemed like it's oh, one, of the, one of the roughest districts in the, in the whole state. Yeah. If, if, if you can come out of that solo district, you got a team. you got a good team. It's, like, it's, it's, it's good games. They're, 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 there's no bad teams in that district. Everybody can play. Okay, do you have any um, any go-to guys on your team? Well, like I said, you know, Aaron Beidelman and Chris Carter are the two senior guards that have been playing for three years or four years. Um, we try to get the ball in their hands. Um, you know, Chris was huge for us down the stretch that second half, hitting jumpers, hitting threes, taking ball to the basket. Aaron, same thing. I mean, we were, when we were tied in overtime, Aaron's one took it to the basket, got us that two-point lead, made his foul shots down the stretch. So, yeah, I mean, th those two senior guards we rely heavily on. All right, well, congratulations on your win, Coach. Thank you. And uh, good luck for the rest of the season. I appreciate it. This Thank has you. been uh, Rick Fields for Cascade Sports.